Jumping out of bed And I still got you in my head From all those pretty words you said It's like I'm wasted Every time I see your face I'm losing track of time and space I don't know where I am It's like I'm wasted and I won't waste it. Good morning! It's been so long since I vlogged, honestly. I think the last time I vlogged, it was still like super hot outside and summery, and it's not anymore. It's fall now. And it feels great. The weather. Yeah. You look great. The weather's been nice. You think I look great? I think you look great. You're so sweet. Thank you. And I promise that I, I will stay. transition from a vlog into like I don't know it's like a month later maybe even more I, I have no idea but I have been really 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 bad about number one not closing out my vlogs and number two when things start getting really really bad and like overwhelming for me I tend to like shut down and I suddenly have a difficult time vlogging a lot of you guys know that I am an introvert and mostly I vlog to help me break out of my shell, help me to express myself, as well as like capture moments, capture memories of my children as they're growing up and things like that. But it really does help me to get out of my shell. But at the same time, when things start getting really, really bad in my life, and when I'm going through things, I tend to have a difficult time expressing it, and I will just shut down completely. I will stop vlogging, and that's kind of what I did after what you guys just saw like this vlog and I really feel like I owe it to you guys to give you kind of like a life update or whatever and just kind of share with you guys now that I'm like past all the bad <laughs> I just really want to update you guys on what's been going on and I want to get you guys up to speed because I have been really really behind on my vlogs another thing I do is that I 
will just like stop doing YouTube for a while. I get I get like really deep in my feelings and I just like stop doing things for myself and YouTube is more of a hobby for me. It's not like my job. I mean it's a job. It it's a lot of work, but like I do it for myself as like a creative outlet and all those things. So basically what happened with this vlog is that I kind of started spiraling after this and just a few things that happened. A lot of you guys know that I co-parent with Lilia's dad. Trey isn't Lilia's biological dad. Caleb is and he's appeared in a lot of our vlogs because he's very involved in her life and he always has been and we are friends and we do co-parent really really well for the most part but when he and I were together we had a very toxic relationship and a lot of times when things get difficult and co-parenting is extremely difficult when things get difficult sometimes he and I don't co-parent very well and we tend to divert back to the toxicity that used to be between us so obviously this vlog was around Halloween time and around Halloween time there were some tensions between Caleb and I and we did get in a really 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 big fight and it kind of caused me to spiral and just like go into like my emotional shell my introvertedness and I I just have a hard time like expressing myself when these things happen basically there was like a lack of communication between us that is like the number one issue that happened is communication issues that ended up snowballing into like a bunch of other things. Caleb is an extrovert where I am an introvert and what basically happened like long story short is he kind of came at me with his feelings and I kind of like went inside myself with my feelings if that makes sense. Some of you might not understand. <laughs> if you're not an introvert that might not make any sense but like I like went inside myself into my shell and like buried myself in my feelings and he like came at me with his feelings and it was just this huge mess. It was like a horrible mess and um, I just like shut down emotionally and I stopped vlogging and I stopped like everything and even when we did talk it out which we ultimately did and it was a really 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 good talk. I mean I don't really need to go into like complete detail but like we hashed out everything and I really feel like we made things easier for ourselves in the future so the situation since has been handled but when it happened it just it sent me deep down into myself and when that happens I have a hard time like coming back out of it I do deal with anxiety, I do struggle with depression, I do deal with all of these things on a regular basis and sometimes I'm able to combat those feelings and I'm able to like come out on top and then other times I, like I said, I spiral and I, and I can't, I can't break out of it. So those things were happening. On top of that, we had a lot of sickness going through our house and I did vlog a little bit of that and you guys will see in future vlogs the next few days, I'll be editing those like sick vlogs and I mean every single person in our house got sick like really 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 sick lots of doctors visits lots of like vomiting lots of fevers lots of just <laughs> like I'm gonna spare you guys the gruesome details you'll see them in the vlogs if you watch them but it has been a whirlwind of like chaos and negativity in my home a lot of you guys know I am the one who does all the filming I do all the vlogging I also do all the editing I do all the uploading I do everything and then I'm also a stay-at-home mom so I'm also taking care of four kids I'm also taking care of this house I am also taking care of like everything that has to do with the family and that is a business in itself so I am literally doing two jobs that I don't get paid to do and it's really really overwhelming and really really hard and sometimes I just shut down completely emotionally and I just I let my feelings get the best of me and that is kind of what happened and so I really I felt like I owed you guys my regular viewers the people that like actually watch and care about us and stay on top of our lives I owed you guys an explanation I also wanted to let you guys know that I am over it <laughs> like I am not I'm not in my feelings anymore I'm actually really really happy and this is a super stressful time of year for me like I tend to get overwhelmed during the holidays all of the gift giving all of the like family get-togethers 
and all of those things so I do get really really overwhelmed but we are trying to stay on top of things this year we have already done a lot of gift shopping and I'm so so excited to have a lot of that out of the way another thing that I've been thinking about and I really wanted to reach out to you guys as my regular viewers those of you who continually watch our videos continually support us I have been thinking about changing my channel name and I've been thinking really, really, really hard about it. And I feel like I want to change my channel name as my littles are growing up. I mean, I do have, obviously, I still have littles. But some of my littles aren't so little anymore. Lily is about to turn nine years old. And I'm just really thinking about turning it into just our family channel and Trey also really wants to get more involved in the vlogging aspect and he wants to get more involved in being behind the camera and he wants to get more involved in just the whole process of YouTube which I'm super excited about because I've wanted him to get involved for a long time so as he wants to get more involved I want to change it more to like our family channel and less of me and my channel so that's just something I've been thinking about but I wanted to hear you got your guys' opinions I don't even know if I'm saying that right did you just spit up all over me but I definitely wanted to hear what you guys think about that so please please in the comments down below let me know what you guys think if you are if you're on board with us changing our channel name or if you really like our channel name and you think that's a horrible idea please let me know that also I'm also really trying to get together like a Christmas intro for you guys and I'm trying to get together all kinds of new things for this channel I, I want to just change everything up and I need to change up my channel banner because it doesn't even have this little guy on it at all yeah I'm a little overwhelmed <laughs> I'm an overwhelmed mom and I try to be as honest as possible with you guys. That is like my main goal with this channel is to just be open and honest with you guys. Even when I do get in my introvertedness and when I stop vlogging. Anyways guys, that is going to be it for this video. And that is going to be it for my life update. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate you all and I love you all. And I cannot wait to catch up with all of my vlogs from the past few months and then finally, finally be uploading all of our Christmas stuff. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you all next time. Bye guys.